30 or 35 numbers are there, students are there. Okay, to get the total strength of third class, okay, what we will do? We will add up those numbers. Yes or no? So, we are using the addition to get the total number. Yes. So, what is the meaning of addition first of all? Yes, addition means putting together or all together. Right? So, what do we use? We will use plus sign for addition. Okay, we will use plus sign for addition. The numbers which are being added in addition are called addings. What numbers are adding in addition, those are called addings. Okay, the result of the addition are called or is called sum or total. Suppose, for example, here I am taking 23 and 12 numbers. Okay, here I am taking 23 number and 12 number. I am adding here. So, we will add the numbers from right hand side or one space value, right? So, first we will add 3 and 2. What is the answer 3 plus 2? Yes, yeah, 5. It is 5. Now, here 2 plus 1. How much? Yes, it is 3. So, 35 is the answer. The numbers which we add, these are called addings. Okay, the numbers which are being added are called addings. And the reason in addition is called sum or total. Sum or total. Yes. Now, properties of addition. Okay, what are those properties? Here, in addition, four properties are there. Okay, so first property is adding with zero. Any number when adding with zero, then we will get the answer as same number. How, for example, here two is it. Here, I am adding here zero to two number. Okay, then we will get the answer as two only. The same number comes as this. Okay, for example, 25 plus 0. How much? Yes, the answer is 25. So, when we add 0 to any number, then we get the result as the same number. Okay, the next property is adding 1. Okay, adding 1 to any number. So, I am taking here 3 plus 1 as example. If I add 1 number to any number, here I am taking 3 number. 3 plus 1, how much we will get? We will get 4 number. Which is just after to this 3 number. Yes or no? So, if we add 1 number to any number, we will get the result just after number to that number. Okay. Then the third property is order property. What is that order is not? Suppose, here I am taking 2 plus 3. Okay. I am taking here 2 plus 3. What is the answer here? We will get 5. Right? Now, here I am changing the order. First number I am writing as second number, second number I am writing as first number, right? So, here order is changing, first number I am written as second number, second number I am written as first number. But still, the answer is same. Yes or no? So, in addition, order property satisfies. The last one is the grouping property. What is the meaning of grouping property? Suppose we are taking more than two numbers, okay? We are taking more than two numbers for add function and here for example 2 plus 3 in brackets plus 5. Okay, so by using bond mass we know that which numbers are there in brackets we will, we will uh, add first those numbers. Okay, so first I will add 2 plus 3. How much 5 is? Is 5. Plus what is the number left over here? That is 5. Right? So, 5 plus 5, how much here? 10. Right? Now, here also the same numbers I am using, but the brackets are for the last two numbers. Okay? I grouped here first two numbers, but in this here, I grouped here last two numbers. Right? Now, the same, which are there in the brackets that we are adding first. 5 plus 3, how much one? Yes, i. It is i. Plus, here what number is left over? 2, right? The 2 number I am writing here. What is the answer here? 10. Both are same. 10 and 10. Yes or no? So, these are the properties in addition. It is uh, adding 0, 
if you add 0 to any number, you will get the same number as result. If you add odd number to any number, you will get the just odd number to that number. Okay. If you change the order also, we will get the same result, the same sum in addition. Okay. If you group the numbers differently also, we will get the same result. Okay. Now, next I am going to explain the examples for addition. Okay? Now, I am giving two different uh, place value numbers. Suppose here I am giving 2, 3, 4, 5, which is a 4 digit number. I am giving here 3, 4, 5, which is 3 digit number. So, two numbers I am giving here to add. So, add. 2345 and 345. So, how to write those numbers in columns? First, we should learn how to write in columns. According by using place values, we have to write the numbers first. So, first 2, 3, 4, 5 I am writing, which is the greatest place values, values uh, digits, 4 digits, numbers, you know, that I am writing here. Yeah? Ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands, right? Now, the next number is 345, which is a 3 digit number, right? Here, 1s, 10s, 100s only day. Yes or no? So, we will start from 100s number. Yes, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, there is no explain which symbol or which sign we will use for addition. Plus, right? Now, we will write here plus. Okay, now next one is addition. How to add the numbers first of all? We will add the numbers from one place to the next place values. Yes or no? From right to left. Now we will add these two numbers. Both are high numbers. 5 plus 5. How much? Yeah, yes, 10. But here we are getting 10 number. Can we write 10 number here directly? No. Why? Here we are getting two digit number, which is a one place and next one is a tens place. So, we should not write 10 directly here. So, once a place value which is 0, we should write here down. Okay. Next one, which is a 10 place, we should send that to 10 place here. Okay. Now, again you have these 3 numbers here. All of them carry. Okay. So, 4 plus 4. How much? Yes. 4 plus 4 is 8. And plus 1. Here plus 1, 9, right. So here 9. Remember, when we get the two digit numbers, then we will send as carry. Left side number will send to carry. Okay? When we get the single digit, here carry is there. But still we got only 9 numbers, not the two digit numbers. So we can write directly here. The next number is 3 plus 3. How much? Yes, 6 it is. 6. So this is 2. The answer is 2690. Yes, this is the sum. These are the addings. Okay, so if both numbers are same uh, digit numbers, okay, suppose 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 0. So directly you can add up those numbers. Okay, in this regrouping, without regrouping also, then regrouping is carry. Okay, when we will get the carry, how to solve them, how to add up. Those are regrouping. Without regrouping this, without carry and this, this problem, without regrouping. How? 5 plus 0, 5. Okay, 4 plus 3, 7. 3 plus 2, 5. Yes. Here, 2 plus 1, 3. Here, there are no carries here. Yes or no? So, this is without regrouping. This is with regrouping. Now, we can also add the numbers without writing columns, right? Okay? So, how to add the numbers by break up, break up numbers? So, here I have taken one example 2845 plus 7. Okay? So, here I am writing here 2845 as usual. But, 7 number I am breaking. Why? Why? Because to get the round figure here. Okay, to get the round figure here, I am breaking this number into two numbers. Suppose, if you add 5 number to 5, then we will get 10 number. Right? So, that is very easy to add. Okay, so that's why I am breaking this 7 number into 5 plus 2. 
Okay, so now I am adding these two numbers. So 5 plus 5 we know. 45 plus 5 how much? Yes, 50. Yes, 45 plus 5 how much? 50. Now other number is same. Okay, so 28, 50. 2850 from this building. Okay, yes or no? Here, 2845 plus 7 is it. Now, we are breaking 7 number into 2 numbers. To get the round figure way here. 5 plus 5, 10. You will get. Okay. So, 45 plus 5, how much? 50 here. Okay. The number which is left over here, that is 2 number. Right. So, 2850 plus 2 is now 2852. Yes or no? So, this is our breaking numbers. We can also break up the numbers in one's place, or tens place, or hundreds place. Okay? Now, I am taking some examples. Okay, now? Next, first one is 2049 Okay? Here, I am taking only two numbers for addition. If I add one more number, 3, 5, 6, 7. Again, I Repeated the same number. This is adding three numbers. How to add three numbers? First, like uh, two digit numbers only we will start from right hand side to left hand side. Our first place to the thousand place will go. Now, first you add these three numbers. Which is the big number here? Nine. Keep in your mind. Nine. Keep in your mind. The next number is 7. Yes or no? After 9, what is the number? 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So, by adding these two numbers, we got 16 number. Yes or no? So, this is the big number, this is the small number. No? Now, keep this number, put this number in your brain. Okay? 16. After 16, again, 7 numbers. The 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Right? Now, we got 23 number. Now, in this number, which is the right hand side number, our one's plus number? Yes, it is 3. So, we will write 3 number here. 2 number as carry. Okay, ma. Now, next one, we will add these 4 numbers now. 6 plus 6. Yes, 12. 12 plus 4, how much? 12, keep it in your mind. After 12, 4. Okay, after 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Now, 16 is in your brain. Okay, 16 after 16, yeah, 2 again. 17, yeah, 18. Yes or no? So, we got here 18 number. Which is the right hand side number? Yes, one place number is 8. Here, yeah, yeah, 8. Again, one is Kali. Now again we have 5 plus 5, 5 plus 5 how much? 10, right? 10 plus 1 how much now? Yes, 11. So 1 number down, 1 number carry. Yes, now add these 4 numbers. 3 plus 3, 3 plus 3, 6, right? 6 plus 2, 8. 8 plus 1 is 9. Yes or no? So like this we can add 2 numbers or 3 numbers of any this is thank you